Today I'm going to make my favorite winter food, vegetable fried rice. So let's get started. Ingredients that you need are 1 third cup of spring onions and more for presentation. Half cup of chopped carrots. 1 cup of chopped capsicum. one cup of chopped onions and a cup of cabbage add salt to taste one to two teaspoons of black pepper one tablespoon of finely chopped ginger one tablespoon of chopped green chilies 1 tablespoon of finely chopped garlic 1 teaspoon of soy sauce or adjust it according to your taste 1 teaspoon of vinegar and lastly 1 teaspoon of white sugar I'm using 2 cups of boiled brown rice but you can even make this recipe with white rice whichever rice you would like to use for this recipe is totally up to you now heat 2 tablespoons of olive oil in a pan once the oil is heated add in garlic after that put in the chopped ginger once you've added ginger and garlic add in the green chilies and saute these ingredients for a while once the ginger and garlic turn golden brown add in the spring onions and saute the onions until softened Once these ingredients are sorted nicely, I'm going to add in a cup of red onions. Along with the onions, I'm going to put in the capsicum. I'm going to saute these ingredients together and wait for the onions to become translucent and allow the capsicum to soften. And finally, I'm adding the carrots. Saute the carrots for 2 to 3 minutes. Now put in the cabbage and allow it to soften. Don't overcook it. Fried rice is actually a very easy dish to prepare, and all you have to do is just to nicely cook in the vegetables and then just add in the rice. Always remember that recipes like fried rice are always cooked on high flame. Now that my vegetables are nicely cooked, I'm going to add in 2 cups of rice and mix them with the vegetables. While mixing the rice and vegetables, do not turn off the flame. Now I'm adding soy sauce to the rice. I have increased the amount from 1 teaspoon to 2 teaspoons of soy sauce. Now add in the vinegar. After vinegar, I'm adding 1 teaspoon of sugar. After that, add in powdered black pepper to taste and then add in the salt also to taste. Now that we've added seasoning to the rice, mix it all together nicely and make sure you don't leave out anything and all the vegetables and rice is seasoned well and do not turn off the flame while doing so so this is it finally the fried rice are ready to be served i'm going to sprinkle some spring onions they're optional i love spring onions so i'm going to do that I hope you liked this recipe and if you did, like it, share it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.